Hi, I'm Maria Palazzola with MyGolfInstructor.com. If you have a problem swaying off the ball with your lower body on the backswing, chances are you're struggling with not only accuracy, but a huge loss of power. So the sway blocker drill is going to teach you how to pivot in place and increase your accuracy and your distance. So learning to stay centered and over the ball and making a proper pivot is going to help you generate a lot more rotational force, which is going to give you more speed in your swing. It's also going to eliminate a lot of miss hits that we have when we sway back and forth, hitting behind the ball, topping it, loss of power, pushing the ball, pulling the ball, and so on. So what I want you to do is take a chair just like I have here. If you can get one that's high enough up that it's going to cover your hip area, we're going to take your non-target side foot or your rear foot and put it with the chair just against the outside of your heel there. And at first, we're going to start with our arms crossed across our chest like this and just simply practice pivoting back and forth. And you want to make sure that you're not going to bump into the chair or run into it. So we're just learning to take our rear hip and let it pivot out of the way. Now, it's really important as you do this, though, to make sure that you get your weight onto the inside of your rear foot. So what I don't want you doing is going the other way and creating a reverse pivot. So again, I'm just simply going to turn here. I'm going to make sure that my weight goes to the inside of my rear foot, but I turn away from the chair. Now, once you get the hang of it, go ahead and try it with a golf club if you've got room and just simply make some slow back swings. Again, turn your rear hip away from the chair. That will help you eliminate any sway that's been, uh, that you've been struggling with in your golf swing. It's simple and it works.